If you're planning to make and sell courses online, one key thing you'll need is a platform to create your courses on. There are so many choices out there and they can be pretty different from each other. That's why today I'm going to share my latest reviews on the best platforms for creating courses online. This will help you figure out which one suits you best. Hi, I'm Kevin, and in today's video, I'm going to talk about the top platforms for creating online courses in 2024. But before we dive into comparing different platforms, let's break down two important concepts. First, we need to understand the difference between a course creation platform and a course marketplace. A course creation platform is basically a digital tool that helps you create and sell your online courses under your brand. Think of it as your personal online school where you're the boss. You get to design your courses, decide how much to charge, and sell directly to your students. On the flip side, a course marketplace is like a giant online school where lots of teachers contribute their courses. It's like a big digital catalog of courses on different topics. Two popular examples of such marketplaces are Udemy and Skillshare. While these platforms can help you get your course in front of a lot of eyes, there are some downsides. The main one is the money. Because you're sharing space with other instructors, the platform takes a cut of your earnings. Another big downside is that you don't get access to your students' emails. This means you can't reach out to them after the course to promote future courses. This is a big missed opportunity because research shows that people who've already bought from you are more likely to buy from you again. Another significant downside is the lack of control over the pricing and discounting of your courses. In a course marketplace, the platform often runs promotions or applies discounts to your courses without your direct input. This can devalue your content in the eyes of potential students and impact your perceived value as an instructor. This lack of control can make it challenging to build a sustainable brand and revenue stream for course creators. So when you're deciding how to sell your course, think about what's important to you. If you want full control and the ability to grow your earnings, a course creation platform might be the way to go. But if you're just starting out and want to get your course out there with, without much hassle, a marketplace could be a good first step. Remember, the choice you make can really shape your experience as an online course creator. If you're looking to grow your business in a way that's both scalable and sustainable, it's important to understand the differences between the two types of platforms, the all-in-one platform and specialist platforms. An all-in-one platform is a comprehensive tool that includes all of the essential features you need to run a successful online business. When I evaluate these platforms, I focus on three key features, website creation, email marketing, and digital product creation. The latter includes the ability to create and sell online courses. All-in-one platforms are an excellent choice for business owners who prefer simplicity and want to manage everything from a single place. While you might not get some specific customizations or features that specialist platforms offer, the convenience of having everything in one place can make this trade-off worthwhile for many business owners. However, not all businesses may find an all-in-one platform suitable. For instance, if your business already has a website or an email marketing setup or both, investing in an all-in-one platform might be too costly or simply unnecessary. In such cases, a specialist course platform could be a better fit. These platforms may not offer the full website and email marketing functionalities of an all-in-one platform, but they excel in specific areas like course creation, enhancing the student experience, payment processing, and product delivery. Moreover, specialist platforms allow you the flexibility and budget to choose other specialist tools to complete your tech stack according to your specific needs. At the end of the video, I'll share my top recommendations for both all-in-one platforms and specialist platforms to help you make an informed decision based on your business needs. Now that we've discussed the key differences between all-in-one and specialist platforms, let's delve into the specifics of some of the top course creation platforms available today. We'll begin with Teachable. Teachable is a specialist course creation platform. It offers a user-friendly interface and a range of features to help you design and sell your online courses. In terms of advantages and disadvantages, several factors come to light. Teachable's Curriculum Builder allows you to easily structure your course by adding sections which can group lessons into themes or weeks. Within each lesson, you can use Teachable's block-based editor to add videos, text, embeds, or PDFs in any order. This gives you the flexibility to customize each lesson according to your students' needs. Once your course is published, Teachable uses what I refer to as the classic sidebar view. This means that your students will see a clickable curriculum outline on the side of their screen and the active lesson on the main 
main screen. After testing numerous tools over the years, I still believe that Teachable's curriculum builder is one of the best. The block-based editor is simple yet customizable, and the student experience is clean and uncluttered. Teachable also has a robust payment processor. It automatically handles and remits U.S. sales tax and EU UK VAT tax, which is a big plus. However, I do think that Teachable's analytics dashboards and sales page builder are somewhat limited. For instance, the sales page builder has fewer block types and customization options compared to other course platforms. But there's a workaround. You can build sales pages on your primary website and have a call to action button directing users to your Teachable checkout page. This tip can be applied to any specialist platform on this list. One major concern is that Teachable has increased their prices in the last year or so while decreasing the functionality of each plan. When I compare course platforms side by side, I find it increasingly difficult to argue that Teachable offers the best value for business owners. This is especially true for those who only require Teachable's course creation functionality and not the website builder and other email marketing tools. So if you're currently using Teachable and you're satisfied with it, I would recommend sticking with what's working for you. However, if you're considering other options or if you're just starting out in the world of online course creation, it might be beneficial to consider other options. One such option is Thinkific, a well-known specialist platform for course creation. The comparison between Thinkific and Teachable has been a topic of discussion for years, as they are probably the two most similar platforms on this list. On Thinkific, you construct your course by adding chapters, which contain individual lessons. When you add a new lesson, you're first prompted to select a type of lesson. One of Thinkific's advantages is that they offer a few lesson types that not all platforms provide, including assignments, surveys, and more customizable quizzes. One significant improvement that we need to discuss is Thinkific's switch to a one-step checkout flow. As a comparison, a two-step checkout flow requires buyers to first create a username and password, before moving on to the second step, where they add payment details and finalize their purchase. This extra step can make the buying process more complicated. However, Thinkific switched to the one-step checkout flow in 2022, which has made the process much smoother. Since then, they've continued to update their payment processor called T-Commerce, including their new sales tax solution. This feature collects and remits taxes from U.S. and Canada-based buyers on, their, on your behalf. For all platforms, I recommend reading the company's help articles to see if your country is supported and if your needs can be met. One last selling point for Thinkific is its pricing. You can get started on their free plan and fully sell an online course with no added transaction fees, which sets them apart. For transparency, some of the features we covered are on the paid start or basic plans, but all plans include unlimited courses and unlimited students. I believe most business owners will find their plans straightforward and packed with value. You can use the link in the description to get started with Thinkific for free. And by the way, if you're finding this review helpful, I hope you'll give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more helpful videos. Thrivecart is another specialized platform that was initially designed as a checkout platform for services, digital products, and physical goods. Their checkout platform remains excellent and is one of their top advantages due to its high level of customization. In the past, you've had to integrate your Thrivecart checkout pages with another specialized platform like Thinkific or Teachable to deliver your digital products. However, in 2021, Thrivecart introduced a new feature called Thrivecart Learn. This feature allows all Thrivecart users to create and sell online courses in entirely within the Thrivecart platform. You can add modules and then individual lessons in this curriculum builder. And with each lesson, you'll use Thrivecart's block-based editor to fully customize your content. This includes embedding videos and adjusting fonts and colors. However, it's important to note that unlike other course platforms we've discussed, Thrivecart does not natively host files or videos. So if you choose Thrivecart, you'll need to host your videos elsewhere. This feature might be provided by your video recording or editing tool, but you might need a second tool just for hosting, which you can find generally for under $5 a month. The student experience in Thrivecart is user-friendly and similar to other course platforms. The fonts and colors are highly customizable, which adds to the overall user experience. One reason why Thrivecart has become so popular is because of their one-time lifetime price point, which offers unmatched value. In fact, even if you purchase Thrivecart Pro as well as the optional Learn Plus add-on, the total cost is still comparable to or less than just one year's subscription to the average course platform on this list. This value is hard to beat. So despite its quirks, as all platforms do have, the value of Thrivecart has made it one of our top specialist picks for online course creators. You can learn more by visiting the link in the description below. 
Next, we have Circle, a community platform that offers course creation functionality as well. This makes it unique among the platforms on this list and worth considering if you want to create a tight-knit community around your courses. Circle is a platform that is designed for businesses that want to prioritize community. With your Circle community, you can create different types of spaces. For instance, you might add a post space to facilitate discussion, an event space to share your upcoming schedule, and a course space to create a curriculum. Within a course, you can add sections that group your individual lessons. Then, within a lesson builder, you have the option to show or hide primary media like a video and use Circle's block-based editor to include additional text, files, or resources for your students. You can also enable or disable comments to encourage discussion. On the student side, here's a preview of one course space which shows their progress, as well as an individual lesson which uses the classic sidebar view along the right. Circle also has both iOS and Android apps, so your members can interact on the go. It's worth mentioning, too, that Circle is incredibly user-friendly for both business owners and their members, which is a huge advantage because the easier a platform is to use, the more likely people are going to actually use it and get results. Also, since community and two-way instructor interaction are growing trends in the online business industry, I think Circle is a great choice for any business owner interested in selling memberships or courses with virtual elements or community. You can learn more about Circle by visiting the link in the description. Circle is an exceptional community platform with robust course creation capabilities, making it one of my top recommendations for anyone looking for such tools. The fifth platform is Kajabi. We focused on specialists so far, but it's time to switch gears and talk about Kajabi, which is currently our number one pick in the all-in-one platform category for online business owners. Not only can you sell courses and digital products with Kajabi, but you can also create a full website, publish a blog or a podcast, run a community, sell services, and build your email list all in one place. If you use the majority of these features, then Kajabi's price point really packs a punch. When it comes to the course creation experience, you can add modules and lessons in the curriculum builder. Then, within each lesson, you can feature a video, audio, or neither, and you can add additional information with the rich text editor. You can also attach downloadable resources and enable or disable comments. I think Kajabi is a great choice for business owners who will value simplicity and the ease of managing everything in one place. As another advantage, because they're so well established, Kajabi also has a wide ecosystem of third-party specialists and service providers. So whether you want a Kajabi website template or a virtual assistant or somebody to build your site for you, it's easy to find support as your business grows. That said, the downside of simplicity is constraint. If you're looking for advanced site customizations or email automations, then Kajabi might not be able to do exactly what you want it to do. It's still highly capable, but if you know you have a specific vision, then an all-in-one platform in general may not be a right fit for you. Overall, I think Kajabi is an excellent fit if you want not only a course creation platform, but an all-in-one home for your business. The sixth platform is System. System is another all-in-one platform and a budget alternative to Kajabi. But the specific reason why they're on our list is because System is currently the best budget course creation platform for online business owners. They have a free plan that lets you sell one course with no transaction fees. In the Curriculum Builder, you can add modules with individual lessons, and the Lesson Builder is very flexible with a lot of blocks to choose from. For some, it might feel a bit overwhelming, but it does give you a lot of options. On the other hand, you don't currently have the option to customize the color of your course beyond the drop-down menu. The request for custom course branding is currently on System's public roadmap, but there's no set timeline on that. For a tool with this many features, System was much easier to learn than I anticipated, although the interface isn't as modern as some competitors. System.io offers four distinct pricing plans, including a free option, making it accessible for various budget ranges. The free plan is available for $0 per month, allowing users to explore the platform's basic features without any financial commitment. Even though it has some unique features like any platform, System is a great option for people making online courses, especially because of its free plan. If you're looking for a free platform, System is a solid choice. You can learn more about System by visiting the link in the description. Now I'd like to share some quick insights about a few more platforms that are often inquired about, but didn't make these top ranks. K-O-O-L. School is another community platform that provides interactive learning and networking. School is a... 
School is becoming popular, but my biggest issue is the fact that you can only have one community, even if you have two plus courses. So I find it harder to use and recommend since I know many business owners run two plus offers that need different access levels. Kartra is also worth mentioning. Kartra is another all-in-one platform. However, I consistently find Kajabi easier to use, both as an admin and a student. Also, at the time of this recording, Kartra is slightly more expensive than Kajabi. Podia is a good option too. If you like simplicity, then Podia could be well worth a try. But if you want customization or advanced features, it's probably not the right pick for you. LearnDash is our top pick if you're looking for a WordPress plugin rather than a standalone platform. I would only explore this if you're confident in your WordPress skills though. Learn Worlds is also worth mentioning. This platform allows you to add interaction points to your videos. It's the best choice if you need SCORM compliance. Gumroad and Patreon are both great options for selling digital products, including online courses. These two are grouped together because they share the same core issues. They lack a true course creation tool. The real issue is that you pay Patreon 5 to 12% of your income or Gumroad 10%, and both are far too high at scale, so I can't recommend them at all. High Level is an all-in-one platform that includes deal creation and CRM management, so if client work is a part of your long-term growth strategy, it might be worth exploring. But for transparency, my testing to date has been minimal. Lastly, we have Squarespace. Squarespace allows you to build and sell online courses directly through your Squarespace site. The catch, though, is that they'll take a 9% transaction fee unless you purchase a paid monthly add-on called Digital Products. And that add-on price alone is comparable to some of our specialist picks. So since there's not an obvious money-saving decision, it'll come down to whatever platform you prefer. We've gone through a lot of information here, but I want to emphasize this crucial point there isn't a single best platform for creating courses. Instead, there are various options available, each with its own strengths and weaknesses, and the best choice depends on the specific needs of your business. To choose the right platform, I recommend conducting a needs assessment. This involves making a list of all the features that are important to you. Start by asking yourself whether you need an all-in-one platform or a specialist platform. Then get more specific about your needs. Once you have your list, it will be much easier to compare different platforms. You can watch our free side-by-side comparison videos or start one or two free trials based on the recommendations we've discussed today. After working with hundreds of course creators, I can confidently say that most people won't find one perfect tool. Instead, you'll find a tool that feels right for you at this moment. I suggest running a few tests to see what feels right for you and then trust your instincts. Any decision you make will likely be the right one. If you found this video helpful, I hope you'll give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel so we can continue to share more simplified online business tutorials in the future. And while you're here, check out another video that I think you might enjoy. Thank you for watching.